Each year we come together in April as a community to bring awareness to the issues surrounding sexual assault and to honor the courage of victims who come forward. At the state attorney's office, we foster an environment where survivors are supported, encouraged, and guided through the criminal justice system. And our goal is to pursue justice always for those survivors and their loved ones. We understand how crucial this is to the healing process and the empowerment of survivors. We know many victims often suffer in silence, afraid to come forward for a myriad of reasons. Our Special Victims Unit is dedicated to handling these cases and always uses a victim-centered approach. We've dedicated many resources to this unit in the form of 14 talented lawyers, five dedicated victim advocates, and many other support staff who work daily to assure the needs of each survivor are addressed and to guide them through the process. Our unit has handled more than 150 sexual assault cases just last year alone. We process new cases as they are reported, but we also refuse to believe that the perpetrators of these crimes should escape accountability simply because time has passed. We aggressively pursue cold cases. And with the advent of new DNA technology, we constantly look for ways to identify and hold perpetrators accountable. Just last January, our sexual assault cold case unit tried and convicted a 48-year-old Jacksonville man of sexual battery. He had met the victim at an internet cafe in 2010. He lured her to his apartment where he sexually assaulted her. Justice was delayed but not denied. In 2016, the victim's sexual assault kit was submitted to the Florida Department of Law Enforcement as part of the Sexual Assault Kit Initiative. And as a result, the case was reopened after DNA confirmed the defendant's identity. There was more. The perpetrator was linked to two other sexual batteries in the Jacksonville area. The survivor's long journey to justice was finally realized 10 years later. And this is just one case. There are plenty of stories of justice being achieved through the hard work and dedication of our office and our law enforcement partners. But it all starts with a survivor bravely coming forward. While COVID-19 has made interactions with survivors a little bit more difficult this past year, we've worked with our community partners and adapted in innovative ways to assure that every victim can be heard. In line with this year's theme of I Am, I would like to remind you that we are here to advocate for the rights of victims. We are here to hold predators accountable. We are here always to pursue justice.